A young woman loses her parents and siblings in a fire. You're looking at video from the scene. It happened back in September inside an East Point home. She is very special. Mm -hmm. Sean Lay introduces us to Mia and explains how she's using her tragedy to help save lives. I know that I can't sit on my butt all day, every single day for the rest of my life, knowing, or not knowing, but not doing anything, you know? Like, I can't do nothing just because something bad happened to me. I have to do something about it. Mia Radosovic is only 17, but you can tell how driven she is to do something positive in the face of a tragedy that would break so many of us. Last fall, Mia's parents, Steve and Yasmina, and little sister Anya died in this horrible fire at their East Point home. Mia was the only member of the family who was able to escape. It's kind of more like you're on survival mode. Survival by being surrounded by loved ones. Joe Zago, owner of the Carpet Guys, is Mia's godfather. I went, you know, straight to where their house was. I saw the it, the house has, in fact, been burned down. And then from there, I went straight to the hospital where Mia was being treated over at uh, St. John's. Joe says the family took the battery out of their smoke detector because it would go off when they cooked. A candle left lit, he says, caused the tragic fire. Mia and Joe have teamed up with the American Red Cross to be a part of the Red Cross Sound the Alarm campaign, helping the Red Cross install 100,000 smoke alarms in homes across the country, 3,000 in Detroit and Ann Arbor, three for every home. Mia tells a powerful story. Uh, getting the word out to people about preparing their homes for uh, fires, it's not an easy it's not an easy path. It's a it's an uphill battle. Since the Sound the Alarm campaign launched a few years ago, 582 lives have been saved from those Red Cross smoke detectors. 16 of those saves from right here in Michigan. Mia knows she will help save a life with a smoke detector. Wow, that was Sean Lay, and Mia will save a lot of lives yeah, with will. this. Mia and Joe Zago are also working on Mia's own nonprofit. They call it Mia's. It will focus on fire safety and all things home safety. She's such a brave young woman. If you want to be a part of the Red Cross Sound the Alarm campaign for your home or to help with the effort, go to the Red Cross website. We'll put it there for you and click on Detroit.com.